Very warm welcome back everybody. Today we're looking at the southbound uh, Warwick services. There is also another episode dedicated to the northbound side, but uh, we're concentrating on the southbound today. So let's zoom in and have a little look so we can get our bearings before we go to the drive through. So the layout is a little bit different from uh, the northbound side. One comes in on the slip road here and it's all single lane in unlike on the northbound side where you need to go on the right hand lane for HGVs and the left for cars. So this time actually it's HGVs and caravans and so on that are off first. Now it's not particularly well signed in terms of uh, signs stuck in the side of the road but it's very clear from the tarmac on the ground where you need to go so you just um, follow around with coaches and HGVs. It's not specifically signposted caravans I don't think but it seems pretty obvious. And then you pull into the car park here and these are double length spaces. So uh, if there's a space pull right the way through to the front so that somebody else can park in uh, behind you or alternatively if you end up parked in uh, behind somebody who's there for a very long time then you will need to reverse out. Um, that looks like there's a reasonable amount of space for doing that unless there's lots of people parked up at the top here where this white topped lorry is then you might have a little bit of difficulty but the, the visibility is not too bad actually because of the angles involved so you should be able to see reasonably well whether you can reverse out safely or not and then you come round um, now the coaches here are in the, the top side in the uh, drive forward reverse out spaces but coming out you come forward and you're directed back onto the main road where the cars are all coming in now. So it can be a little bit busy here obviously because this is the, the main route in for the cars but the bonus is of course you then can access in the same way as every other car the fuel station. So you just come around the bend here with the cars instead of going right to get to HGV fuel you carry on where the cars are going and then you follow the car route down here come through here and then into the car refueling station and that's pretty simple you know there are wide wings on the right there are wide wing wide wings that's a bit of a mouthful there are wide wings on both the right and the left hand side so there should be a pump available that it's pretty easy to drive in and drive out through and then if you've gone in the fuel just follow out in the normal way and you end up back going down the slip road and back on the motorway okay so it's very simply laid out um, but as long as it's not crazy busy it works quite well so let's get to the drive through Okay, well, well done, welcome break. Uh, it was smelly and we did see a couple of rats running around at the uh, verge in the car park, but at least it was well signposted and easy to get into and spacious. So, well done, welcome break.